Hell yeah, I did that without taking damage, I think. <laughs> Unusable. Oh, I probably have to reconnect it. Delivering cargo. Thank you. We've all been feeling the loss of Central Knot City. No one seemed to know what it meant for the organization. Or the UCA. Or us. The Oxytocin will take the edge off and that'll be a big help. Won't be long before we're back on track. We may have a look. <laughs> this is great. Thank you again. Yeah, everything looks to be in good order. And soon our way station will be too, I hope. Oh, wow. You're with the second team, right? Where are the others? Oh, they're dead. dead. Caught in the void out. No way. That one blast got them all? And what, they just sent you out on your own? I mean, if it was just a delivery, that'd be one thing. Porters come through from time to time, but... The second team was meant to bring the Cupid. They were gonna connect us up. Three years we've been waiting for help. Three years! And they sent us one guy who was... Shit, shit, shit! Tell me you brought more than the Oxy, at least. I've got the Cupid. You... Really? So it's true. They finally got it working. Well, then you just might be the answer to my prayers. So, what are you waiting for? But you, you put us on the goddamn grid? Yo, brother, you're talking to me. <laughs> I've, I've been waiting. Oh, what the fuck? Even the baby woke up. New day for UCA. The following structure cannot be constructed using the PCC post box. Uh, this area is not connected to enabling you to see the access to other player structures. Oh. Connection to Capital Not City confirmed. It's really happening. <laughs> Just like Amelie promised. We can finally do what we came here to do. Hey, you're headed west, right? Gonna be a lot of people happy to see you. I guess you'll keep on till you hit the coast, huh? Which means you'll get to see Amelie in person. Oh, that's something. That is really something. I... Me, I've never met her. Only seen her hollow messages back when I was with the first expedition. Oh, what was that? Anyway, pause. You best be careful on the road. There's some bad people out there. More than good, some say. <laughs> but I don't need to tell you that. Thank you, Sam. By bringing that way station into the Cairo network, you've put it in direct contact with those of us back here in Capital Knot City. Right. What's next? West of the way station are a couple of structures our previous expedition put in place. And beyond them is your next destination, Port Knot City. It's on the shore of a crater lake that formed after the first void out. Your objective is to link up Port and Capital Knot. But to do that, you'll need to utilize our facilities as additional waypoints. They'll be essential for establishing a stable connection. Given the distance we need to cover, we're looking at using a distribution center and a power station. As to which you should head for first, start with the distro center. We've got some cargo that needs delivering anyway. Check the nearby delivery terminal to pick it up. Okay. Good work. New order available. Please access delivery terminal for further information. Order assigned. Sam, assuming you've got your PCC in order, head to the site I designated and build that post box, would you? You 
You should have no trouble finding it if you check your map and come from time to time. Sam, I see you've arrived at the designated site. Good. When you're ready to proceed, activate your PCC. Use it to build... What? Whoa. That's a 3D printer on a new level. to store cargo and the like. What the fuck was that noise? Heads up, Sam. Your cargo's been pinged. Move. Now, before someone has eyes on you. Get to your destination ASAP if you don't want to get caught. Yeah, I thought that was the items that we could use. Fuck. What is even that? I don't know what the hell that is, but... Let's go! Okay, chill. Let's go. Come on, Daryl, slow. Slow. <coughs> Shit. No need to rush the low. Cause there's like a poachers. I guess bounty people. Fuck. 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 Oh, it's after down. Deals gave you trouble, huh? Could take you the ring. Even they know better than to mess with BTs. Time for what's the the passage of time for anything it touches, exposure, time for <gasps> the cargo. Uh, come on, Daryl. I'm not too far from cargo, lost cargo, time fall resistant wood. Hmm. What? Too far from cart? What? Oh, was there something I missed? Come on now. Go, 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 go.
Oh my god, why is it so far away? Metals. Oh no. Okay, I am going the right way, thank god. Oh my god, look at all this cargo. Yeah, I definitely can't carry this. That is way too much. Over here. Go, go, go. Okay, I think they're gone. Oh my. What happened? Something wrong, Sam? I don't know. Kid doesn't look so hot. <sighs> Nothing to worry about. Its functions are temporarily suspended, but they can be restored. I can perform the necessary maintenance at a distribution center. Hurry, though. Fuck. <clears throat> when the strain on your BB exceeds sustainable levels, it triggers the production of harmful compounds. 
and the body, in essence, begins to attack itself. It's called autotoxemia. If your BB's not performing to spec, drop by your private room and see if the incubator helps. Oh. I pushed him too much. Oh. I don't think I pushed them that much. Come on now. <laughs> oh, it still works. Oh, hell yeah. Is that a car? Fuck. That is a car. <gasps> W clutch. Beginning scan. Scanning bridges ID. Verifying ID. Clear. All weapons will remain locked until the party. Cargo verified. Thank you. Oh my god, this shit looks all fucked up. Decontaminating suit. Rest is advised. Yeah, I'm def yeah, I definitely gotta rest. After this, into the UCA. Recycle? Whoa. Air is not connected to the... Looks like we're on the chiral network. And with those materials you brought for our chiral printer, we can produce supplies for you here as needed. Okay. Think of it as our way of returning the favor. Now head west and keep on doing what you do. Good. The distro center is on the network. Sam, do me a favor. Take your BB to a private room and connect it to the incubator. Good work. <laughs> what the fuck? Okay, hold on. Fuck, these things are getting more and more damaged. Okay, let me see. Take one. Okay. 
Okay. Gonzo, a goat. <laughs> okay. <laughs> God. Yo, that shit, that, that nutty is so odious though. Hey, what the fuck is up? We're playing a uh, um, Death Stranding, the director's cut. I actually fuck with this one. This one seems a. Uh, I'm a few hours in, and this this is a. Uh, I like it. I like it. Little help. A lot of people saying we're saying that this game was a. Uh, it wasn't cool. Uh, I don't know. I fuck with it. It's a. Uh, it's it's dope as hell for me. Right now, our jit. Something's wrong with our jit. Ten. Good. Uh, a temporary excess of stress. Easily addressed if we return it to its mother's womb. Mother? Wait, what? Uh, located in the capital not city, ICU. Brain dead, of course. Ah, uh, you mean still mother? Correct. A still mother's womb facilitates a connection between the world of the dead and the BB. And you, in turn, Connect yourself to a BB, granting you the ability to sense BTs. Oh. These pods were designed to simulate the conditions inside a still mother's womb. BBs need to believe they're in one at all times to function properly. However, we can only maintain this deception for so long, which is why we must periodically update the environmental data by synchronizing it with a still mother via the chiral network. So, what's the thing about these jets? There. The update is in progress. Right now, the pod is synchronizing with the still mother in Capital Knot City and reconfiguring its settings based on the latest data. Returning your BB to the womb in this manner will temporarily reduce its stress levels. What about that how do we do it permanent? It technically belongs, of course. Kid looks happy. I'll try adjusting the oxytocin dosage. Autotoxemia should set in much slower from now on. You should remember that BBs are just equipment. Try not to get attached. Each one has been physically removed from its steel mother's womb. A process that renders them unpredictable and prone to failure. Wow, okay. No BB on record has remained in service for over a year. Uh, it may need to be retired before this expedition is over. And then... You're saying there's no way to keep my baby alive? <sighs> you must understand. There is still a great deal we don't know about BBs. Yeah, like are they As we expand humans? the network and recover more past data, perhaps we'll find our answers. Uh, oh, right. You asked me to look into why... Because the way that they're describing it is that... Uh... I spoke with Hartman. 
We should have your results. They're not soon. humans. There's something else that we don't know. Anyway, a lot about it. You and your BB are both exhausted. <sighs> Good night, Sam. That's kind of cool. Like if, if um, if I'm just roaming around, my character gets fatigued. But not only that, the jig gets fatigued as well. Oh wow! Okay. Oh shit, here we go. Fewer and fewer people in the cities these days. No one's having children anymore. But humans aren't made for living alone. They're supposed to come together. To help one another. And if we as a people can't do that. If we can't reconnect. Then, well. It's like Bridget said. Extinction. Come on. Rebuilding America isn't going to get rid of the BTs. As long as they're still around, there's no escaping it. But at least we'll have hope. Damn, it's like a an introvert and an extrovert. I'll be waiting, Sam. Waiting for you. Come and find me. Is it <laughs> Jesus. Damn, all all brother wanted was to Hello, Sam. This is Hartman. Since you're awake, it might behoove you to freshen up. To that end, why not take a shower? It's good for the body and soul, and also my research, as it happens. All my brother wanted to do was uh, deliver his packages. arise try using it on a bt i'm curious to see how they react who knows it may even prove beneficial to you there was an old research paper detailing the effects of bodily fluids from individuals like us on bts 
It is only by recovering these materials that we can unearth the knowledge of the past. Not just the Death Stranding, but also the mystery of your body's unique properties and even our doom's affliction. There may well be hope for humanity. Sam, I have no interest in rebuilding America. I want to recover the past. Five, oh, four, it's almost three, time. Two, one. After you make your connections and nothing happens, then what? I said, then what? Uh oh, what was that countdown for? Sam, sorry to bother you while you're taking a break, but I figured you'd want to hear this. Hell, maybe it'll help you rest easier. We received a number of messages addressed to you. I've not taken a look myself, but I gather they're mostly from your clients. You should see if they contain any useful information. Mail can be accessed via your cufflinks, as well as the terminal in your private room. There's something else I'd like to share with you. With the Cairo network, we now have the power to reclaim our past. Data once thought lost forever from every corner of America can be pieced back together from fragmented records. Our archives are still a work in progress, of course. But as we expand the network and integrate more way stations and cities, we'll be able to recover more and more information such as the previous expedition's logs and reports. Everything they sent back was lost when Central Knot City was destroyed. Now we've managed to restore some already, in fact. You can access them from a private room terminal or your cufflinks by selecting Archives. Might make for interesting reading. Everything in your palm to save BB. We are. But we cannot release your son just yet. Believe me when I'm telling you. Your son? This is the woman in the mask who's done nothing but lie to me. Sam, there's something I forgot to tell you. It's about managing your BB stress levels and reducing the risk of autotoxemic attacks. There are a few things you can do if your BB starts showing signs of distress. Such as? Such as take a moment to look after it. Cradle the pot, gently rock it, that sort of thing. Out of curiosity, how's it doing at the moment? Uh, before I answer that... Something wrong? When I hook up my BB, I see things. What kind of things? Like a face, someone I don't know, calling to me. There's this room, too, with other people talking, but I can't make out the words. Uh-oh. Mm, Bleed-through effect. Didn't I warn you about this? You're mistaking the BB's memories for your own. They're false flashbacks, nothing more. Let me explain. A BB is harvested from its steel mother at around 28 weeks and placed in a pod. To be clear, this is before it's even born. The procedure halts its development. But even at 28 weeks, its sensory systems have matured enough to process external stimuli. Oh, okay. It's more than capable of encoding this information into memories, which can bleed into yours via your connection. So who's the man I saw? Someone from the medical team, maybe? Or a BB technician? Does it matter? The BB has been in circulation for a while now. It's been handled by a lot of people. How should I know which one made an impression? Because you're the expert. No one's an expert, Sam. BBs were developed decades ago in secret. They're your quintessential black boxes. We may use them, but we don't truly understand them. Believe me, I've been trying to learn more, but almost all of the old records are gone. If I find anything out, I'll tell you, all right? Dead man's honor. Okay, uh... 
Yo, why do I have so much shit on my back? What the fuck? Is this like the packages I found? Oh my god. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Oh, okay. Hey, what's up, uh, TNI75? Thanks for the thanks for the raid. I appreciate you. Can't think of anyone more qualified than you. There once was an incoming raid filled with friends who enjoyed what was played. Although my skills may stink and drive me to dream, <laughs> there's still a uh, say T. You mighty, you're mighty. Okay. Ah. Yo, what the fuck is up? Uh, we're, we're just playing some Death Stranding, you know. Um, let me see, what am I doing right now? Collection... Cairo Printer Interface. Okay. Mama's added a watchtower schematic to your PCC. If you don't have it on you, consider fabricating one. You never know when you'll need to recon an area. Yeah, this is my first time ever playing a Death Stranding. Um, so far, you know, uh, so far I like it. A lot of people were saying that Death Stranding is pretty much a, a walking simulator. Um, but to me, hey, I'm really fucking with it. I, I, I fuck with the, the story of it. And, you know, I've, ever since uh, yesterday, I've just been playing this uh, for the most part for the gaming portion. Okay, let's see. What am I doing? Uh, okay. Before we head out, let's uh make sure to deliver the the lost stuff. That thing you're holding is a crystal collector. Now, as the name suggests, it provides secure storage for any crystals you gather. Yeah, the crazy thing about this is, even though it's kind of older, uh, allow me to describe your the quality. <laughs> oh, this is exactly what, what I was trying to get. The quality is fucking impressive as hell, dude. Got all that? Hmm? Rain, floating rocks, golden handprints. That's your trifecta. The Look intro of this game, it literally felt like it was a, like a legit movie. <laughs> I was like, holy fuck. Alright, let's uh, deliver all this stuff before... Begin the Have a pleasant journey. Yeah, I thought this was um. I thought God of War was the most imp uh, visually impressive ones, but I don't know. This one is this one might be second place for me. Okay, let's see. Where are we going now? Let's cover on a collection recovery. Import city into the Cairo network. Retrieve the Cairo printer. All right, fuck it. Let's go over here first. Name Sam. Yeah, let's go over here first. They really said the ball high for games to follow it. I can see that. Lifted. 
Yeah, not only that, when when you're like traveling from uh, uh, point A to point B, they have like the the beautiful fucking music. <laughs> that beautiful fucking music. And hey, since since uh, I'm a huge fan of uh, music, music as you can tell with the uh, all the shit back there, makes the game so much more fun. But most mules almost always bring stolen shipments home with them. Find the post box, steal oh. back the cargo. Simple as that. But be careful. These guys are armed. If this goes sideways, be ready to fight. What? Ain't no way they want me to fight with just my fist. Come on now. <laughs> Come on now. You like the uh the thing on the uh, uh playlist? Okay. Yeah, I, w I was uh, thinking of doing that too. But I'll probably do that at the end, just so I don't spoil myself with the uh, the music. Remember, Sam. Before you approach the mule drop site, we recommend you use a watchtower to confirm the location of the post box. Oh, 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 oh. Fuck. Ah, oh, shit. Okay. All right. All right. Let's go. Mule drop sites are rarely deserted, so remaining undetected is key. Keep a low profile and move slowly to minimize noise. Oh, that's kind of too late. I think. Oh. How fucking convenient. Okay. Yeah, I have way too much stuff on me. Um. God damn, 26 damage. Fuck. Okay. So where are we going? I'm right here. <laughs> the most stealthiest fucker out here. Oh. Okay, so I have to go down there. Yeah, there's no chance. My shit is already uh too fucked up. I guess my equipment load is too fucked up. Oh my god. I keep forgetting that I should probably not move too fast cuz I don't want to get clapped. <laughs> when infiltrating a mute cam crouching will help. Okay. I mean, anchor, mute boots. So there's only one enemy here. Nice. Um, okay. Oh my God, 
this is going to be too much stuff on me. Oh, I already have way too much. Ah, damn it. Okay, can I? Fuck. Okay. I thought that was equipment. <laughs> oh shit. Hold on, hold on. Damn it, dude. I really should have left uh, my stuff back. Okay, let's go for it. Skadoosh. Skadoosh. Run! Run! Go, Daryl, go! That easy. Oh fuck, oh fuck. Let's see, there was a there was a pod here. Maybe we could Oh my god, okay. Alright, let's go. Fuck it, let's fight him. Fuck, 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 fuck. No, we can stealth it, we can stealth it. They're not gonna give up. Come here, bitch. Fuck, 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 fuck. <laughs> Let's go. Still. Oh shit! Beautiful. Fuck, 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 fuck. Been busy. Seems all the mules in your vicinity have been incapacitated. Okay, so I think I might have uh, left. I might have left the key item in here. So let's uh let's check in here. Cause I I was literally uh looting I guess. And that's probably why that shit is glowing red. Right, let's see. So from what I saw, I need like a, a printer. Oh no. Oh, what is that?
There we go. Oh, a memory chip. Okay. Okay, so I need to find. What do I need to find? Uh, Cairo printer interface. Ah, oh, there it is. That's my okay. And then what's that? Hey. Okay, so okay. I I thought um I thought like key items I couldn't place in the private the private storage area, but I guess we can. Oh my god, this is like the most clutch, <laughs> the most clutch world uh, so far in this game. Yeah, need to be careful. Come on, there, you're scaring me. <laughs> Almost there. I need to replace my boots as well. Beginning scan. Scanning bridges ID. Verifying ID. Clear. All weapons will remain locked until departure. Cargo verified. Thank you. Let's go, Darrow. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Not a plus decontaminating suit. All clear. Well, stand for the bridges. That was a headache. shoes falling apart while you're on the job carry on like that and it's only a matter of time before you injure yourself i've arranged for boots to be added to your supplies bridges standard issue so they ought to fit you fine you should always carry an extra pair but if you forget or run into trouble you can fabricate another via a terminal at one of our many oh facilities. that's clutch good work sam seems your connection level is increasing as your connection level increases larger quantities of resources will be made available to you at our facilities
Oh my god, this game is Zero. achievements galore. Congratulations, Sam. I understand you now have access to a chiral printer. An extraordinarily useful device that can only function because of the manner in which our network utilizes the beach, enabling us to transfer massive volumes of data instantaneously. Since under normal circumstances, such transfers would take hours, if not days, some have speculated that the chiral network might, in essence, be a time machine. That it is transmitting data into the past. Mm, so okay. I need to say, we have yet to fully grasp the fundamental nature of the network and the beach which we have come to rely on. One might liken our relationship with it to that of primitive mans with fire. Is it useful? Quite. Is it dangerous? Undeniably so. Nevertheless, we have decided that the reward outweighs the risk. Furthermore, as the BTs are linked to the beach, it stands to reason that further study and experimentation could be of considerable benefit. The same could be said regarding you, of course. <laughs> Rest assured, I will keep you apprised of what I learn. You have my word. Good work. Let's fucking go. Okay, we're we're probably gonna wrap up uh tonight's session after this. After this, I'm basically just gonna grind. <laughs> well, thanks. You did me a real favor there. Uh the phone cannot be viewed. This is, I'm gonna call it a night there.